Yeah, the second thing is the government side, right? We are beginning to see, you know, two distinct trends emerge on the government side. Mm. One is they would love to create um, a cloud environment leveraging their existing infrastructure. A lot of these state governments have big data centers. They have invested in hardware. They're yeah. not running a cloud. Their applications are all disjointed. You know? it, yeah. So a lot of state governments are progressively taking an approach that we will cloudify the whole thing, mm. run the infrastructure, and various departments can run their software on that true, cloud. True. So they themselves want to provide that element and they want somebody like Airtel to come and run it. Yes, because it's just not about data center, it's about connectivity. You want to make sure that when people move to cloud, they're accessing it not through a data center, but they're accessing from different government offices. There is local breakout. They're using internet to connect to cloud as opposed to coming through a data center. The connectivity and network design is a very different challenge True. when you have application going to cloud. Yeah. So we are helping state and local governments to do it on-premise if they want on-premise. But there is a lot of governments today which are also flexible to say, I don't mind moving it off-premise because mm -hmm. my data center is either old, my hardware is out of mm -hmm. life. Why yeah. don't I start afresh? But mm -hmm. I can't go to a hyperscaler. We need a sovereign cloud. We need somebody um, who's an Airtel brand, like an Indian brand, who can manage it. And we have been serving all these state and local governments anyway. We provide connectivity anyway. Yeah. So yeah. you can imagine that we're just having connectivity. We get that cloud set up in our extra yeah. data center, if you will. You know, I talked to you about that. Yeah. Then that becomes our data center layer. And then we put our cloud layer on top of it. And we have the flex cloud model um, again on top of all of this help to help them manage. That's another big data localization push we are doing.